Watch out by the Canary. I'm looking for some cargo. You're in luck. Cargo all around. Take your pick. I could use your assistance. I'm looking for crates sealed by the Orlesian Port Authority. Haven't seen any. Sorry. Talk to the Arbor Master. I'll bet he's got information about your cargo. He's in his office. Hey, if you're done wagging your tongue, can we get those sacks off the docks? Shipping manifest. I'm looking for cargo bearing the seal of the Orlesian Port Authority. Oh, Adam, deal with this. I apologize on Liam's behalf. He is a very, very busy man. I'm Adam, the Harbour Master's assistant. I understand you're looking for Elysian cargo. I have seen the crates. I can't remember where. Such a shame. Get to the point. The clink of gold coin often jogs my memory. Is this enough to help you remember? Ah, it's coming back to me. The cargo is in Alton Woodrow's warehouse. By the dock. I'm glad we could help each other out. Someone coming. This is private property. What are you guarding? Imported goods. Who owns this warehouse? Master Woodrow, I suppose. It's rented storage space. Let's see what's behind that door. No visitors allowed. You're in my way. We're under attack! Now that's just rude. What are they trying to do? Ruin my boots.
Watch where you step. We're good to go. This is some potent stuff. You could wipe out all of Hightown with just one vial. You're smuggling poison. I thought you were trying to change your ways. I got the stuff from a legitimate supplier, and I'm going to sell it through legitimate channels. It's all legitimate. It's poison. It kills people. I just sell it. I'm not responsible for what people do with it. So, where is it? I refuse to be a part of this. You want it, get it yourself. Oh, come on. If I don't get the goods back, I'm ruined. Why don't you make this worth my while? <sighs> this is all the coin I have on me. Now, will you please tell me where my cargo is? Woodrow's warehouse. Ah, sweet music to my ears. And probably worth the steep price. Knowing you killed every raider in there, I'm gonna get my goods. You come back once I'm set up, I'll give you a discount. Blood mages have infiltrated your ranks. They've been implanting your recruits with demons. Sweet blood of Andraste. De demons? Did you say something about the recruits and demons? I didn't want to tell you, Masha. They... they were horrible. Those mages see the rest of us as ants to be crushed. They won't stop until they've destroyed the Chantry and the Templars forever. Tarani was crazy. Magic didn't make her that way. True, not every mage gives in to temptation, but none are ever free of it. At any time, any mage could become a monster. 
from the lowest apprentice to the most seasoned enchanters. Mages cannot be treated like people. They are not like you and me. Surely that's a little harsh. Maybe we shouldn't be arguing with the nice Templar. Smile and nod. Smile and nod. They are weapons. They have the power to light a city on fire in a fit of pique. There's fault on both sides. We must find a way to live in peace. Perhaps you're right. Perhaps mages need better education as to why the Chantry functions as it does. Perhaps they would not go against the will of Andraste herself. I will look into it. For now, Karen, unless it is proven you are free of demons, I must strip you of your commission immediately. No, you can't really think that. Karen's fine. He's safe. He deserves mercy. What happened wasn't his fault. Please, sir. I tried to resist. I never took anything they offered. I... I need this position, or my sister can't eat. I've been training for five years. We conducted tests on Karen. He's not possessed. He can stay in the order. I hesitate to ask what methods you used that you are so certain. Still, you have done much for us by stopping these blood mages. I will heed your request. If he has shown no sign of demonic possession in ten years' time, Karen will become eligible for full knighthood. Thank you, Sarah. Again. But without a full knighthood, Karen's pay is so small. I do not know if I can reward you as you deserve. I will handle that, miss. You have done the Order a great service. We will not forget it. This ring is all I have to return to you. I'm sorry. Oh. Ninette's wedding ring. Yes. Look at the engraving. Forever faithful. Forever yours. Oh. Written in happier times. Where did you find it? Just know that she will not return. It's better this way. Our marriage has been in shambles for more than a decade. I'll send the ring to her family. With luck, it will appease them. Thank you for all your help, Sarah. Make her watch over.
Welcome, merchant. Here to sell today, guardsmen. Where did you get off to? And what are you planning? Bartrand. So suspicious. I have, in fact, brought us our future partner. What? Partner? You stupid, nug-humping dirt farmer. Why did you go promising something like that? Because if we don't get this expedition moving, brother, then we won't have any profits to argue about, will we? Hmm. Maybe you have a point. So we're partners? That depends. You got the coin we need? Are we talking a full share here, or what? If you have the coin, sure. You'll get a full share. That seems like a lot for an expedition. We're going lower into the deep roads than anyone's ever dared. Who knows what we'll find down there? Well, that means food and equipment and hirelings. None of that comes bloody cheap. I will get the coin, I promise. And how about you tell me when that happens? Until then, you're not much of a partner. Relax, Bartrand. Have I ever let you down? You don't want me to answer that. Found your mystical hoard of coin yet, human? I do have your coin, in fact. You're joking. What did I tell you, Bartrand? Not bad for a human. All right, partner. Full share of the profit between you, me, and Varric. Now we just need a decent entrance into the deep roads. These might be just what we need. What's this? 
Three? Four entrances into the deep roads, all in the free marches? Where'd you get these? Didn't I tell you we could find a Grey Warden? Mother didn't raise a fool. Well, she didn't raise two of them. Well, color me astounded. We just pick the most promising one, and go! Time to wrap up any business you have in the city, my friend. We'll be gone for several weeks, at least. Let me know as soon as you're ready, and we'll head out. <laughs>